thing where the CEO said he was going to make uh, you know theaters for texting. Well, yes. They got a ton of backlash and now they will not allow texting at movies after all. There you Yay! go. Because I was the one that was one of the ones that was up in arms about it. Like, I'm not going to lie. I went on social media and I bashed him. Not really. <laughs> Thank you. But I should have. <laughs> well, the thing is, is who wants texting? You know, it's like, come on. Like, I mean, seriously, we go to movies to get away from stinking texting. Exactly. That's the two hours that we can avoid, you know, put it on silent and say, shut up, leave me alone. I'm watching a movie. Yeah. Well, the internet went nuts over it. Some people thought it was a good idea, but a lot more people thought it was terrible. And thankfully, those people won out after all the backlash. AMC posted a tweet on Friday that said, quote, no texting at AMC won't happen. You spoke. We listened. Good. There you go. Yeah. Oh, there you man. Go. Like, seriously, we were we talked about this and we were going, no, th- this has got to be a joke. This dude's really going to allow texting <laughs> in his theaters? Well, I remember we were thinking, what are they going to do? Like, make a special kind of theater or what? Yeah, like we were thinking yeah. texters over all the way to the left or certain movie times would be designated for texters. Yeah. like I was trying to figure out how the crap it was going to work. I like that one. I like, okay, the 8 o'clock showings for texters. Yes. If you know for a fact you're going to text <laughs> and you absolutely cannot stay away from your phone for the entire hour and a half, two hours, wow. then you go to this movie and this movie only. You know, imagine that showing. It would look like when people turn on their lighters at concerts back in the day. Remember? Yes. That's the way it would look in there all the time. Mind you, that showing would be full of, like, say, uh, teenagers of my child's age. Yeah. And, um... Ay yes. <laughs> it also stay off their phones. It also included a statement from the CEO who originally suggested it, and he said that after hearing the feedback, it was obvious that it's a concept their audience does not want. No, it was obvious it was a stupid idea. Like they should have actually. And whoever just, came up with it needed to be fired. They should have thrown it out as a "Do you want this?" before uh, just saying that they're going to do it. Yeah, you know, seriously, because even we were saying, um, whoever this is coming from in that company. Mm-mm. That whoever it is apparently is addicted to texting themselves. Exactly. They thought it would be a great idea. So, take hold. It's not going to happen. Good. There you go. Now we're happy again. Now, mind you, doesn't mean there's not going to be any texting during movies because it still happens even though we don't like we like it or not. True. And I'm the Ching that really wishes that someone would go around and monitor that no one would text. Yeah. I'm the one that says, because somebody come over here to this idiot in front of me because I always end up behind. Like, honestly, you just I'm telling you right now. wish that the ushers would make more noise about it. Yeah. Because it happens. It's annoying as crap, man. Yeah. Get Keep an eye on these fools. No texting, please. And they show that little film beforehand, don't they? Can yes. We? Mind you, do we have AMC theaters here? <laughs> um, that's a I good think question. We're for nothing. Yeah, we don't have AMC in the 4th or 2, so we're good. Maybe. <laughs> 